Breaker, breaker. Hey, Bonsai Buckaroo, this one's for you. I uh, mentioned in the video of this the other day that they can do more. Well, not really more. You know, uh, I've explained to some of the amp builders and some other techs, you know, how to come up with average power. It seems like most of them got lost in the, you know what I mean, they always get lost. But anyways, it still does the same amount of power, but you can carry a little bit more sound in the sidebands like this, or what some people call louder. This one had to come out of the box, and out of the little box it was in, and while it was sitting here, I figured, you know, I'll, I'll do a video. i just seen your comment, so I figured I'd show you. You know, yeah, by the way, shipping's like once a week anymore. There's way too many radios to be going back and forth to the post office, and now it's like a truckload every week. Yeah, I personally take them. I don't let the mailman pick them up, take them away, and bounce them through the truck all day long. I might see one issue per two, three hundred radios, you know. I think that's a pretty good uh, average. So let's see. Four to one. Pretty cool, huh? And that is on a freshly real 400 megahertz <laughs> NIST current traceable scope. Pretty nice, huh? Let's see, what do we got? Looks like 24. Yep, yep, yep. Not bad, huh? That's the way it should look. That's what everyone's trying to achieve. They try. But you better watch out for those meter baiter Houdinis. They're out there everywhere, you know. They usually come from, like, Facebook. Uh, so let's take a look at it like this. Pretty cool, huh? Alright, no, I'm not looking to be, you know, answering questions on 500 HR 2510s. Would you please do mine? I'm not really interested in old radios. They're old for a reason. They're old. Yes, they're damn good radios. I figured this would be uh, educational. Buckaroo, you always make a lot of comments. Sometimes you make me grind my teeth. But that's alright, man. That's alright. It's because they yeah, have to work on the new stuff, too, you know. But Kevin, just don't take the screws out. Y'all stay tuned in. Did you learn anything, see anything that you uh, learned? Click like, subscribe, stay tuned in. If you're curious about this video, go one video down. Click it. You'll see a little bit about low-level versus high-level modulation. It's hard drive here at fine-tunedcbshop.com. I'm out of here. Click, click.